Well, hello, good people. Mark Holmes here, and as always, I appreciate each and every one of you guys, as well as you ladies, for joining Cooking and Tailgating with Joe Boo. And this is a um, money-saving tip here for you. Um, the thing about cooking is, and it, you know, it's, there's so many wonderful things that you can cook, and um, the way you can save money, especially if you have a big group or a big family and stuff like that, is, is actually by shopping around and buying on sale. Um, I'm sure you don't really need to know that, but I want to give you at least one of these amazing deals that... Um, that I, I still can't believe right now. I go to Restaurant Depot, and also there's BJ's and, you know, uh, Costco's and Sam's Clubs and things like that. But what you really want to do is don't go to the store and say, oh, I got a taste for chicken, and let me go to the grocery store and buy some chicken. Because chances are it's probably not going to be on sale, and going to the regular grocery store, it's going to cost you more than if you buy it in bulk. Bulk is your friend. So at Restaurant Depot, this week they have chiclet, boneless chicken breasts on sale for 99 cents a pound. The only problem with this is that you have to buy 40 pounds of it. And that's what I have right here. Okay, I want you to, I just want you to think about this for a second. I know when we come up the road and we stop off at, say, um, uh, but, but, but Wendy's. And everybody gets a Wendy's meal and all that stuff, and I get a thing of chili to go with it. And there's three of us. It's usually about $39. Yeah, $39. This is 40 pounds of chicken breast that costs $40. So here's what I want you to understand. That means each one of these are about six and a half pounds of chicken breast, right? Six and a half pounds. That's a lot of chicken breast. Each one of these bags basically costs me $6.50 a piece. There's six bags that are right there. Now, you're probably saying, but I ain't got that kind of freezer space. I get that. But let's say you've got some friends or family. If you say, hey, buddy, I got 10 pounds of chicken breast for you, fresh, for 10 bucks. You want to go in on it with me? Yeah. And you get a couple of people because... If you do a lot of entertaining or cooking and stuff, and chicken breast, it's great because I can go ahead and season it up and, and, and basically uh, uh, sear it and then boil it to make chicken broth out of it and then take the chicken and shred it for like tacos or for salad or chicken salad and stuff like that. I can grill chicken breast out there and make a big sub. I can do a lot of different things with this chicken breast, but it's not only chicken breast because my dad said, you know, Get me some chicken drumsticks. Check it out. Chicken drumsticks. Chicken drumsticks. We're on sale for 40 cents a pound. Got to buy 40 pounds of it. But guess what? <clears throat> 40 pounds of chicken breast only cost, <coughs> excuse me, $16. So a box this size full of chicken drumsticks, $16. It's a lot of chicken jump strips. If you're tailgating or if you've got a big family or you got a family get together, you buy there and you can cook like crazy. You could literally get, think about this for a second. Let's see. You could get six boxes, six boxes, 240 pounds of chicken drumsticks for under $100. That, my friends, is how you get ahead with the prices of things going up. If I go to the grocery store right now, I'll be lucky if I can find chicken breast for $2.98 a pound. $0.99 cents a pound. $0.99 cents a pound. Um, anybody out there need some chicken breast? Because I don't know that I have enough space in the freezer 